don't know what it's going on on the observer's side, but everything's working on my end this time. Yep. If not scuff on Alexia, it's scuff on me. At least it's not hardware scuff on that in this time. No, it's just internet scuff because you you know it's like it's always like that. So it's, uh, it's, it's always sun scuff. This time around, it's yep. internet scuff, which is fine. I guess it's fine. Uh, it will just make take time for you to uh, to um, grace us with your presence. Speaking of presence, you just spawned on my face. Yep, usually do spawn in the middle of the screen. Uh, Man, my glasses are playing havoc with my eye tracking today. Yep, same, same, same here. I mean, I could take them off, but I don't want to deal with the headache, so... Okay, and we are in. I'm also... I'm going to be blind today. Hey, Zapelli. Because frankly, I don't want to deal with the with my janky model today, because it, apparently something with the... Something, today, something with the tracking... Because uh, usually BTS? my yeah my model today my model isn't nearly as janky with glasses as, as it is today. Yeah, I'm having that same issues. Like my wa eyes are just going all over the place. Okay, BGM chatting is turned off. I'm gonna be starting my uh, thingy thing for you. Okay. Oh, there you go. There we go. There we go. Downsize this, downsize this, activate this. Captain on the bridge. I think I can switch us over here hey, with Reaper. I don't have Discord. There we go. Now Discord's showing. Okay, and also, also because it's usually not fucking working for some reason when I when I switch out the game and switch back in, game back in. Yeah, as usual. Uh, let me let me do something. I need to like reset it. I need to reset it again. Okay. Uh, ha, ha. Yes. Okay. I'll restart. I'll just restart the stream with you for you in a moment. That sounds good. Okay, should be okay. There we go. Uh. All right, I've somewhat fixed the tracking for now. I did not want to bother with it. I'm going to be blind. I just took my glasses off and recalibrated. Okay, cool. And there we are. Okay. Captain on the bridge. Hey guys. Finally are uh, yeah. somewhat okay with the, with everything. For now at least. 
Oh, it's not weird to be in both of those guys' chat, by the way. Um, also, before I forget... Before I forget... Before I spaghetti forgetty. Before you forget... That's for you. Do you hear everyone? Do you understand what is happening on the screen, guys? Do you perceive it? Kiko. Coolio. Gonna be doing today, uh, probably gonna not gonna be doing a long longer stream. Um, gonna be doing one chapter today. One yep. chapter, and then I'm gonna be doing another chapter next week. I think that's that's a good uh, that's a good pace, good pace, good pace. Because I I objectively yes. didn't prepare much this week. I'm gonna be going to, this week. I'm gonna be going pretty much by the ear. I think having a schedule is too stressful for me. <laughs> objectively. Yeah. I tried that then it was just like too much pressure to just keep up with the schedule and everything felt inorganic yep um it's like i get really tired and burnt out for from not like being object uh objective in how i feel so if i don't want to stream this day i'm just gonna say i don't want to stream this day but most likely i will maintain yep. a lot of my current screaming capabilities right yeah, see, if I tell myself I'm going to stream regularly without making a schedule, it's actually easier for me to do it. Yeah. Like, for example, today I wanted to do, uh, I wanted to stream before I stream, uh, before I do, um, before I do the uh, Honkai Impact, right? I wanted to, uh, I am, I'm, at, I am in school, so if I don't talk, that's why, that's fine. Uh, but if, I, but then I want to do, maybe I'm going to do Fate after this. Okay. Like I'm, I'm going to do try fate Samurai Remnant after this, instead of before this, because I simply woke up too late. <laughs> I understand that. Yeah. I actually didn't go to sleep till about 5 a.m. I uh, I ended up watching uh, a TV show with a friend for, for half the night. Like yesterday, we sat around uh, 10 p.m. Maybe earlier, a bit earlier, and then we separated around uh, 6 a.m. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes you just get, you just get carried away. Huh? Yep. And speaking of cold carried away, let's start the cold front. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Hello there, May. <laughs> So we're starting off with May, okay? Yeah, her in her thunder, uh, thunder form. This ought to be interesting. Sure, sure is. Let's uh, begin. Let's uh, begin. We're gonna be jumping into the story for f like first fall, first thing because you know, I feel like it's yep. uh, it's best. It's it's beast. So what this is what is this all about? May meditated silently in the digitally constructed space. It was a familiar state of being for practicing Kenjitsu and allowing her to attain highest levels of focus. After reacquiring her Hersher powers, she spent most of her time in, in a sealed in the sealed training cabin. This was the place where she could forget about everything and concentrate on what she needed at the moment. Any module activated, initiating environmental algorithms, projecting virtual training targets. The cold artificial voice Hello, echoed Zaz. its protocols. Hey, Zaz. Uh, several mechs materialized and landed heavily on the ground. May opened her eyes slowly, gri gri gripped her weapon, and drew it with a def deafening hum. Ooh. Training system, algorithm complete, gathering battlefield, gathering battlefield. Uh, 
Oh, she's she's fucking hard, going hard. Yep. Dragon. Oh, and the dragon comes in. Oh, and he just smashes everything. Oh, okay. She completely smashed everything. In a very short period of time, and the slow clap. You're a hard-working girl, Hersher of Thunder. Oh, Jackal. I mean, I'm not surprised Jackal was the one overseeing things. She's the scientist. Wild sp electrical sparks dance in the air. The shattered mechs disintegrated in into Dagda fragments. May, little, may silently sheathe her blade. The digital environment disappeared and rever revered the poorly lit corridor. Someone hid in the darkness approached slowly. The Honkai energy within you is stabilizing. I knew it. You can indeed wield these powers. I've said I don't want to be disturbed. Don't be so mean. We're friends, and friends are supposed to get along with each other. <laughs> I really want to get to know you better. Stop wasting time, Jackal. Oh, Raven. Jackal was suddenly interrupted. Raven appeared out of nowhere and stood between her and May. Get on with the business at hand. Just spoiled all the fun. The time has come for you to unleash your powers for this serpent, Biden May. Imaginary singularity observations predicted a Honkai event that she'll create an apex inch the crucial to her plans. Uh, scientific speak translate. I imagine this is this means a Hersher is appearing. Yep. Yes, you know it, Raiden May. I give birth to a Hersher like you. Simply put, a key objective of Project Stigma is to acquire every single Hersher. But our sire will personally lead this mission as he is busy elsewhere. Understandably, uh, understandably that they, they decide to choo choose May for of all things to do this. Yep. This is our chance as our sire's most steadfast followers to prove our devotion and ensure the, su the success of Stigma. Red and May, your power will be an indispensable weapon for the World Serpent. This is why we need to work together and face the impending Honkai eruption. I will honor my promise. But treat me as a friend. We're both using each other for our own ends. I'm a mercenary. I'll treat anyone as a friend. So our mission is just to kill a Hersher? No, a dead Hersher means nothing to us. The Serpent needs a suspended Hershers. Suspended? Mm -hmm. Prepared a small gift for you. Behold, the scepter's duot. It was of the underworld. Mm -hmm. Jekyll reeled a golden black box measuring several inches long. It looked like a mask of the uh, Tutankhamun. Tutan ha Tutankhamun. Ah, Tutankhamun. Yeah, it's basically like a. It's an Egyptian thing. Egyptian thing. May did not know what the box contained. Uh, like its maker, the box made her feel extremely uncomfortable. Huh? Oh, must be the imaginary disruptor mentioned in the briefing. Disruptor? Please. Do not sully this majestic device with such common 
Yes, some marble from the previous era that even Shiskel couldn't replicate. You can't even fathom its value. Could be told, I hope you can experience its powers for yourself. Unfortunately, these scepters are too valuable. Our resources only let us craft eight of them. Do not do be prudent with their use. So, how do you use them? Good question. You'll know. While the masked lady chuckled, a slight vibration accompanied by electrical noise have spread through the corridors. May heard an unfamiliar voice in this electrical data stream. Attention, everyone. A Honkai eruption occurred at the southeast Asian island city of the Coral just a minute ago. Shishkal has deployed their Valkyries. It's time to start our mission. Who's that? <laughs> That's a good question. And it okay. seems like Jackal just wants to sound more important and more knowledgeable than she is. Mm-hmm. Jackal is definitely... Um, how do I say it? She's definitely a, a piece of work, but she's a smart piece of work. <laughs> Meanwhile, at the Federated Autonomous Region of Coral in the Pacific Ocean, the Immortal Blaze Valkyrie squad led by Durandal arrived at the zone 30 minutes after the eruption. The Valkyries readied themselves for combat at the outskirts of the island city. I just heard... Uh, Durandal's voice starting, voice line started in the background. So I'm guessing we're yep. playing Durandal this level. Possibly. The Valkyries read themselves to come at the outskirts of the island city. I'll meet her! <laughs> Fellow Valkyries, ETA to our objective is now five minutes. I'll be running through the mission briefings. Kind of glad she's, she's alive, though. <laughs> yep. The eruption took place at Coral, an artificial island with 1.8 million permanent residents. Located at the border of Southeast Asian and Oceania, Coral is a key economic and commercial hub of Pacific. Pacific. Pacifica. <laughs> 30 minutes has passed in the eruption. Honkai has spread across the entire island. Things aren't looking good. And we have some really bad news. Lost contact with the Snow Val Lotus Valkyrie get squad garrisoned on Coral. Snow Lotus Valkyrie. Mm -hmm. Our Val guard Valkyrie formations have sealed the region and established a forward operating base. Mm -hmm. Upon arrival, the Immortal Blades shall punch through the center of the Coral and pave away for other squads. The Overseer also gave an order. The World Serpent will be joining this battle as our allies. Shiskel forces shall carry out the standard anti-Hankai operations and leave the Hersher to the Serpent. Roger. All Valkyries to battle stations. Interesting. Yeah, it was definitely Durandal. Okay, we're playing Durandal. Immortal Blades, move out. And Rita! Whoa, what a duo! <laughs> That'll be interesting. I love this, uh, oh yeah. I love the system, uh... These, uh, immortal, I assume these are the Immortal Blades, uh, officials. But uh, later, the Immortal Blades right. have landed. Our current location is the bridge connected to the outer rim of coral. The Immortal Blades must secure the bridge to enter the city and set the defensive line. Rita and I will take the care of Honkai. Have other others initiate the rescue operations and help the survivors back the place. Roger! 
ついてきてくださいこちらです Damn though, the way <laughs> once once again uh, the the game is proving that it's constantly increasing in quality. Look at the look at the oh, yeah. 3D effect, the the 3D level uh, feel of it's this feel. Much better. The backgrounds are so much better now. Yep. Smoke engulfed the bridge of the city. The disaster continued to spread and consume the gem of, this, of civilization. The immortal blades advanced cautiously and pu pushed the chaos back towards the cart of coral. Squad leader, Honkai levels are, are rising in coral. We just picked up a Hersh's energy signal in the city district. I've sent you the coordinates. This location, Master Durandal, the place is where we lost contact with the Snow Lotus ten minutes ago. Follow me, Rita. We must give him our support. Understood. But, squad leader, the overseer told us not to engage the Hersher. Unauthorized actions might be punished. Be flexible, elevator. Our mission is to clean up the Honkai. That would include helping the squads that lost contact. Oh, that's right. We won't be disobeying any orders that way. You're so smart, Adjutant Rita. Have the others proceed as planned. We'll need to meet the at the specified coordinates. Understood. Hmm. Yeah, makes sense. Okay, that 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 makes sense. Yeah. I heard this. Uh, this level is more of a world building slash. Yeah, I can see it. Ooh, ignite bomb. Cool. Especially with the change that they put in there with that. Cool, cool, cool. Daily side quest. There is a daily side quest here. That's interesting. At least May or Sakura battle suit. Okay. At least one May or, or Sakura battle suit. That's, that's good. That's good to know. Uh, May or Sakura? Do I have any May or Sakura? I do have May. Sakura, I mean. Dark Ball Jonin. Just need to end up grading it. <laughs> yeah, seven, 47 is good. Is good, I think, for now. I can, like, level it up later. Rater? I'm such a Japanese boy sometimes. <laughs> Rater. Okay. Yep, Hi you don't have the uh, materials. Yeah. There you go. Do 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 I love how we do a to do do fuck you. <laughs> uh, that was that's funny. Okay. Okay, whatever. Uh. 
I'll need to later do these later uh, once I have the materials. Yep. For now, though, I think I think it's fine. I'll still I'll still most likely play still most likely play just Durandal. <laughs> Probably. I mean, Sakura's weaker at the moment. Yeah. Okay, so we have a good setup. I know how, how she just eats the, the the thing. Yep. Like when when someone tries to when someone tries to. Uh... Oh, space. How you doing, space? I'm just uh, playing some uh, Durandal. Yeah, this one, this one, I don't even need to like race for time, unlike the previous. Scene. Right. Yep. I figured you're new. Uh, I welcome you here. I welcome you here on this channel. I welcome you to on this uh, thing. We are st we are basically going through chapter 18 today. Uh, yep. It has been fun so far. Well, uh, we'll do these later. It's like just daily side quest stuff. Right. For now, I'll, uh, let's continue with this. Okay, Rita and Durandal are back uh, on action, back in action as usual. Durandal has become like my favorite unit to play. <laughs> I can believe it. She's uh she's very acceptable to my stuff. Ooh. We're playing alongside Rita. Apparently, that's interesting. And she's sure going ham on this, on everything. <laughs> Hello, yeet. Oh yeah, yeet. <laughs> He'll handle it. Master Durandal, the bridge doesn't look good. Traveling with the pipelines might be faster. Okay, let's go. It's a bird! It's a plane! It's Durando. <laughs> the monsters look like Pokemon. They kind of do, huh? Oh, why am I not surprised bit. she's flying? Everyone else runs, she just flies. Well, I mean, Bronya does the same thing, so... Yeah, but she floats. This one is straight up flies using, like, celestial elements. I love how uh, summoning the, the spectral knights. To, 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 she, she clearly has a lot of uh, a lot of various abilities she could use. She can use on the uh, this puzzle. How thoughtful of them. We must carry forth. Rita, time is running out. Understood, Durandal Sama. They do look kind of. Uh, 
Hello, May. I did, mate. Well, they are working together, yep, so... They're gonna fight. No, they are working together. May... I still think they're gonna end up fighting. Probably, but yeah, May, May, May is working for Serpent. Durandal is working for Shiskel. They're currently cooperating. Uh, so May might, might be willing to... Raiden, May. Raiden, May. Maybe. Didn't expect you to join the World Serpent. I have my reasons. That's all you need to know. Turns out, Miss Raiden is the old, is the ally our seer mentioned. The World Serpent must be stretched thin to send its newest member to such a dangerous area. Isn't this Miss Rita Rosewise? How are you doing? You're Raven. Your concern is appreciated. Unlike Shiskel, the serpent doesn't like human wave tactics. We may be few in number, but we will complete the mission. Oh my. How rude of me then. Her to smile, but her uh, her gaze turned as cold as steel. I wonder what you'll be using against the Hersher. Gas? Crap? Or suicide bomb bots? Hey, bro. Ha, hey, Dr. Frederick. Hello, Frederick. Well, I didn't expect to single-handedly ruin your mission last time. I'm still very sorry about that. I can cut the sarcasm in the air. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh dear. Please don't. I should be the one who's sorry for ru ruining the grand project of Heliopolis life sciences. You're welcome. Do take care of our supplies and make sure the tea is ready when we handle the Hersher. How nice of you. In return, I shall make you sure you're given a proper funeral if you get yourself killed. <laughs> this banter is funny. <laughs> ah, yes, I shall give you a proper funeral if you die. <laughs> You're being too kind. You should try to be safe back here. Things might get very dangerous. Dr. Frederick is the one watching the stream. Oh, nice. Welcome then. Indeed. You should watch your back as well. The two girls continue sparring in their smiles as their smiles stiffened. Tension rose in the air. Rita? Durandal's gentle voice reminded Rita of her indis in indiscretion. The Valkyrie bowed slightly and took a slight step back. Apologies. I do not intend to fight Shiskel. I extended her hand to Durandal as a gesture of her goodwill. Durandal looked a girl. She had changed much since that short-lived battle at Dark City. We're not allies with the same goals. We should focus on our mission and try not to get in each other's way. Our Valkyries will garrison in the outskirts to contain the Honkai and evacuate the survivors. According to our arrangement, you'll be fighting the Hersher and we will try not to interfere. Thank you. The Hersher is moving quickly towards the center of Coral. You should set up quickly. The Valkyries then extended her hand to May to cement the alliance. Miss Rosewise, I suppose we can shake this and declare a truce. Um, this game is very dialogue heavy because it's a very alive, uh, visual novel style inspired storytelling. Um, there's a lot of story storyline involved. Uh, some chapters take up to four hours to finish. Um, yes. 
Uh, Durandal is an interesting name. Roland Sword from the uh, titular ballad of Roland, if I remember correctly. Yep. Um, Durandal. Yep, that's correct, Frederick. Yeah, Durandal is the strongest Valkyrie in Chisco, which is one of the three factions currently operating within the world. There is World Serpent, which are which is led by the Kevin Kaslana. He's like this big ancient warrior person that wants to eradicate all of the bad stuff, the Honkai, with the most extreme measures possible. Recently, in the previous chapter specifically, May, Raiden May, which is one of the three main characters of the story, joined the World Serpent in order to eradicate Honkai and uh, have her friends live a peaceful life forever after. Obviously, yep. she chose the most extreme faction because she, she no longer gives a shit, objectively. <laughs> <laughs> like she has reached much. way past the point of giving a fuck. Uh, Actually, made her much more likable as a character. Yeah, before that she was kind of whiny and indecisive, but then she kind of broke out of that, and now she is the way you perceive it now. Um, she has thunder powers. She is very uh, or oriented on thunder. She can summon her own dragon. She's very strong. Durandal is still the strongest in the, uh, Valkyrie in Shaskal, but there's, there should be competition with the, with the World Serpent, because there's some very powerful individual in the World Serpent. There is Shaskal, which is the main force guarding the world right now. It is uh, controlled by Otto Apocalypse, one of the main antagonists of the entire story so far. Like, he was the entire... Uh, and uh, Durandal is the strongest weapon of Shisko, and uh, Rita Rosweiss is like one of the strongest one as well. Um, recently, uh, Otto and Kevin struck a struck uh, a deal that allowed them to work together, and the third fa faction will be anti entropy, which is basically like science uh, techie robot kind of feel feel. feel. Uh, anti entropy is interesting because their leaders are almost exclusively named after our uh, big known scientists. So there's Einstein and there's Tesla. Yep. Um, those are those are the main focus um, people. Uh, also, Welt Yang. If you guys know Star Rail, Welt Yang is a person in anti entropy, and this is the exact same Welt Yang that you see in um, Star Rail. If you played Star Rail before. Yep. But yeah, uh, that's basically the setup here. Hersher is like the big node of Apocalypse that gets summoned every every once in a while. Uh, they can either go berserk. Yeah, Tesla was in our party for a while. One hour goes by and it's cl uh, even not even close to the end of the dialogue. I mean, it's not uh, one hour dialogues. It's just a lot of, lot of dialogue it's between stuff. Multiple chapters, yeah, yeah, but yeah. remember, it's kind of like a visual novel, so it's dialogue heavy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will not shake hands with the one who murdered my comrades. Oh my, you're so emotional. Swish. Raven took a step forward, but found the tip of Lance pointed that, but straight at her. Do not push your luck. Whatever. I see that my efforts are not re reciprocated. Raven gave up and returned to my side, but Durandal, rolled, Durandal lowered her weapon and left the place together with Rita. The best Valkyrie of Shuskal is one, is one tough. Enough. Let's go. Hello, Radera. Hey, Radera. And now you see right in May. Look at this. Immediate. <laughs> yep. I keep noticing a pattern every YouTuber has a, I've seen has a chat channel name on it. Uh... Yeah, because it's kind of a tradition, I feel like, to have a ch 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 dot uh, with a dot at the end of it. I don't know why, but it, it is a tradition. Well, I don't have that. Well, on YouTube. Oh.
you good? Yep, I'm not streaming on YouTube, so I yeah, wouldn't yeah. know what the YouTube trends are. Uh, we're going there? No, we're going there, I think. I like <laughs> the way her she moves is kind of funky. Yep. It's like, so low jumps. Yeah, tunnel leads to the Coral City District. Oh, Owl will be meeting us there. Owl? Interesting. So that's, I, I assume that's Owl. This is the place. Cold winds blew into their faces when they stepped out of the tunnel. There was nothing but ruin inside. Where's our contact? Look, there he is. May heard live footsteps next to her. Light distorted slightly as the contact revealed himself. You sure took your time. Met an old acquaintance. Had to say hello. That S Frank Valkyrie. Why did you provoke her? What are you trying to achieve? Whatever. I am the old I'm the world serpent officer called named Owl. Pleasure to meet you. I will support you in this mission. You don't need any support. Oh, great. They'll take care of the Hesher. I'll be leaving. I dare you to say that again. Sheesh. <laughs> it was a joke. The man all, uh, named Owl scratched, scratched his head lazily. He's a professional da in data mining and covert operations. He'll be helping us in this mission. He looks like a lazy bag of bones, but he is the best oper He's one of the best operatives we have. Raiden May, Sama, San. Anyway, we have confirmed that this eruption has given birth to the fifth Hersher. I prepared the scepters of Duat according to Jackal's instructions. Defeat her, and we can attempt to capture her. Just call me May. Having said that, May headed directly towards the center of the city. Is she the Hersher of Thunder that our sire mentioned? She looks soft. Can she handle the job? Don't worry about it. Like us, she has every reason to fight. Hmm, we'll see about that. No, this model of uh, this model of May is effective. Is is uh, basically the best model she has, I think, so far. Yep. I came back to Durandal and Roland and chatted. Got instantly Library of Ruin a PTSD. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, Roland is the main character of Library of Ruina. He does his name, Roland. Man, I have been doing all this fighting. I'd appreciate your help, Al. I don't think I my right May is around. I don't think my I'd might much help. I should save my strength for the fight against the Hersher. Why you little? Enough. Any updates about the Hersher? The Hersher signal has stopped moving just then. This is the place where it last appeared. The Hersher is nearby. I can sense it. Ooh. The ice pillar? How could the water freeze in the tro tropics? Honkai energy is seeping from it. Looks like we're right. 
I have very few opportunities to reference the 12th paladin, so I'm going to miss. Oh, so I'm not going to miss one. Ooh, nice. It's kind of fun that we we have the uh, we have the uh, raven on support button. Yep. Dragon. And it yeah, the, rich, the harsh is completing the metaphorsis. The Honkai beast. Keep the Honkai beast off me. Okay. I'm heading to the ice column to target the Hersher. Time to finish it out. Wait, last time he come out a lot, but I don't think it counts. Yeah. Okay, Hersher. Shoot the Hersher. But who's the Hersher? Is it Wendy? Mm, I'm not sure actually. Yeah, Astolfo is still one of the paladins. <laughs> the ice column exploded into a rain of broken ice fragments and revealed the Hersher. Owl acted as soon as the target appeared. Target locked. Loading the Skipter of Duat. Ooh, okay. The Hersher gave a high-pitched scream and unleashed a, scre a stream of biting cold. Water vapor quickly froze into ice shackles that bound the three serpent world serpent operatives. May felt pain piercing through her skin. She was too close to the Hersher and it threatened to freeze her lungs. Not a lot for me to read there. Shen. She says Shen, I think. The Hersher murmured the string of strange syllables. The Hersher murmured while her body twisted and writhed as though she was fighting an invisible creature. No one knew what she was up to. She behaved less like a Hersher, more like a mindless zombie. Despite the target's strange behavior, the operatives knew they could not afford to hesitate. The fight begins. Okay, she used frozen. Those barely take any damage. And we have quantum shadows as well. Which I suppose is not a surprise Those... effect. Dragon just shredded them. The storm blew over. Everything you did sight was sealed in a tomb of ice that formed a massive wall. She escaped? Raven closed her eyes to sense the original Honka in the ice. The Hersher was already far away. She's getting away. We must chase her down. Wait. We can't mindlessly chase after her. That's dangerous. Owl crawled out of the snow and patted his clothes to shake off the thick frost all over him. We've seen what Shersh the Hersha could do. She's tougher than we thought. She may be an even match, but capturing her would not be easy. We need a better plan. She's not wrong. Nope. She's definitely not wrong. That, that's for sure. As you can see, guys, this is like the general pace of this uh, of this kind of storyline. Coral District, East District. Durandal and Rita arrived at the place where Snow Lotus squad lost contact. The frost slowly subliminated and revealed the lifeless Valkyries. We're too late. The two observed them over the silence for those who had fallen in battle. Must bring these brave so soldiers home. Of course. All of you place to you, Rita. I'll check out the surrounding area for any uh, clues. By the way, Frederick, this chapter and this and next chapter are especially interesting in the context of the story because these are the ones who will be bringing more characters into the mix. This one will be making uh, bringing more uh, world building into the mix. And this chapter is also completely detracting from, uh, largely detracting from the main th the main trio and like the uh, the good guys, quote unquote. 
because uh, Kiana and Anti Entropy and um, the third main character Bronya uh, Zaychik are not involved in this, like at all. As far as uh, as far as I'm aware, at least. Doesn't seem like they're involved. Dirindal remained expression expressionless when she turned around and left, uh, but Rita knew something was different. Uh, there's not a lot of Valkyrie badge. Bonk! That's good. That's pretty cool. Okay. And she flies too. I love, I love, I love the her method of flying. I already mentioned it, but I do love it. And now, knights. And it's dead. Mm -hmm. And it's on, on uh, in ice. I guess uh, Durandal really said, uh, nice to meet you. <laughs> okay, that should do better. Yeah. That was a chilling pun, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Very chilling. Okay. Found Valkyria Com device. I mean, who knew you were stone cold? <laughs> yeah. The Valkyria Com device picked up from the ice had a voice recording of what happened during the eruption. Squad leader, we contacted the Oceana branch. Just hold out till reinforcements arrive and. Squad leader, are you all right? Don't get any closer. Leave now. Squad leader, I'm picking up a powerful Hawkeye signature at Energy Spike in... What's happening? Get out of here. Oh. She is the... That's... She is the Hersher. Yep. No, not like this. This shouldn't be happening. Yeah. It was one of the uh, Valkyries. Yeah, Valkyries. The adults scanned the battlefield. The clues and the evidence pointed to one thing. While recovering the Valkyrie's remains, she suddenly noticed something glistening in the sun. What is this? Master and Durandal, the Immortal Blades made it through the outer tunnels and are heading here right now. The other Valkyrie squads have secured major routes of traffic. We've contained the spread of the Honkai. You're holding a necklace, Master Durandal? It's Anna Sharks. It's hers. From what we found out so far, she might be the Hersher created by this eruption. She tried to fight the Honkai corruption, but ended up killing her own squad during the chaos of the battle. I didn't expect things to turn out this way. Master Dundurl, are we to share our findings with the World Serpent? Yes, Avatar sent Anna's data to them. 
What? Are you sure? Gaki data is supposed to be confidential. It's our duty to share necessary data. Where are allies after all? Yoroda looked up towards the far distance where her share might be. Let's just see what they can do. I suppose this is a test as well from Durandal in order to confirm that if there are good allies to be had in this situation. If they are capable of of containing the Honkai, I think they are, go they, they are good to go as allies. Yep. Anna Shariak, A rank Valkyrie, age 18, height 166 centimeters, 851 kilograms. Resume, a rank Shiskel Valkyrie, currently leads the Snow Lotus Squad garrison to the Coral Island. Extensive combat experience. Members of Hearts House Shariak uh, began training to fight at Honkai from a very young age, became a Valkyrie at the age of 12, promoted to her Aang rank at the age of 16, and was made the adjutant of the Snow Lotus Squad. Anna was the sole survivor of the Snow Lotus Squad during the Mania Honkai event in 2015 and managed to save dozens of victims on her own. In recognition of her ex exemplary performance, Shiskel restored the squad with her at its lead, at its head. Under her leadership, the elite Snow Squad saw action in many dangerous battle zones. Huh. Interesting. Yes, quite. Do 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 Okay. Let's do this. The uh yes. Crack! The sound of breaking ice slabs reverber reverberating through the city throughout the city. A section of the ice wall then collapsed with a deep resounding boom. Yes. Good. We finally got through this barrier. Beep. Hmm? And calling call from Chisco. <laughs> Greetings, World Serpent. I'm Valkyrie Elvid here from the Immortal Blades. My squad will be able to share this sh what Chisco has found so far. Durandal ordered you to share things with us? Tell us what you found. Alright, I'm uploading the data right now. What is this? Our findings are showing former Valkyrie Anna Sherrick is the hersher of, the, of this eruption. A Shiskel Vakri? You were as surprised as well. But this is what actually happened. Anna Sherrick was made the squad leader of Snow Lotus last year. The squad was garrisoned in at Coral Island. She became a Hersher during the eruption. Calm records showed that she tried to fight the Honkai, but failed. Anna left after killing the other Valkyries. We believe she still held on to a threat of humanity at the time. And that's why she sealed herself yeah, in ice. That's why she sealed herself in ice. Yeah, that's my name. <laughs> We also found frozen areas with high levels of Honkai at the site of the Hersher's birth. We've yet to discern her exact powers, but we're calling the fifth Hersher as the Hersher of Ice. Yeah, seems like it. <laughs> You've personally experienced the powers of this Hersher of Ice. Does that mean you've fought the Hersher already? Only briefly, she managed to escape. She can create razor-sharp ice shards and unleash devastating freezing blasts, a true nuisance. We'll find a way to neutralize her. 
Understood. I'll tell my squad leader about that. Thank you for your assistance. Very much appreciated. I can see us working together again in the future. Raven smiled. The, other, the Valkyrie on the other end of the video call appeared to be pl pleasantly surprised. Alright, Godspeed and good luck. Raven switched off the comm monitor. She expressions grew somber as she studied the frozen city. You exchange your expressions really fast. It's just a part of the job. We're allies, after all. We need to keep moving and this end this crisis as soon as possible. Not fair. You're right. I will study the skyline of this stricken city. The disaster had begun to spread once more. Looks like we're running out of time. Interesting. Uh, so there's, so far from what I can understand, there is Hersher of the Void, there is Hersher of Reason, there is Hersher of Thunder. Um, that's three. Uh, fourth. Who's the fourth one, actually? Do we know the fourth one? Uh... If this is the fifth one, do we know the fourth one? Would have been uh, Kiana. No, the void. I already mentioned it. There was also the uh, May was a Hersher. Okay, and still May, is. May Thunder, um, Kiana, Kiana Void. This person Ice. That's Reason. That's three. Reason four, and we need a fifth. Okay, so I wonder if and we. And then uh, was uh, it that girl from like? chapter two or three in uh, siberia yeah no she did she was uh she was pronounced not um not a hersher just close to hersher oh uh, no maybe she was a pronounced hersher maybe she was uh, hersher of the wind might be fifth yeah there was a wind one okay fair enough yeah wind went she was she got killed yep she the wind one is dead dead Okay, so uh, reason, wind, void, uh, thunder, and now ice. Okay, that makes sense. Frosted ruin, Act Two. May. Duh. I'm just I'm just keeping track of her search for myself. Coral business district. A heating stove was set up in the middle of the snow-covered street. Navishir is moving towards the Coral Business District. The sensors we've set up in the city were disabled. Last batch of data received showed that the Hirsch spawned numerous beasts along our path. This is interesting, though. This is the first Hersher that is not that is acting like that. Because the previous Hershers were, at the very least, sentient and d driven by something. Sense of urgency, right. sense of... This one is just screaming incoherently. These beasts are creating extremely cold areas that would kill ordinary humans. We must destroy these beasts to approach our target. Even if we could get closer to the Hersher, we need a better plan or she'll just run away again. Indeed. The Serpers, the Scepters of Duat will be crucial to our plan. Can you explain what the device really is? Simply put, mm, yeah. <laughs> I'm dude, please let me lead dudes! <laughs> Simply put, the scepter are limiters that disrupt the Honkai energy output of a Hersher's core. 
Jekyll said that they do this by introducing interfering twists to the link between the core and imaginary space. In other words, the Skepters can severely limit the Hersher's actions without killing her. Usually, these limiters won't last long, but if you severely wound and weaken the Hersher of Ice first, the effects might last long enough for us to bring the Hersher to our sire, who then seal her. With her powers gone, the Hersher would enter into a coma and become a harmless vegetable. Sorry, but I said might sound cruel, especially to a Hersher like you. I all apologized to me, but it was Raven who replied. Cool. Since when did you become a kind person? We do have a Hersher in our team, though. It's alright. If that is the only way, I'll do what it takes to finish my task. Interesting. <laughs> she really is. I like I like Mei that doesn't talk too much. She's just like, okay, sure. <laughs> yeah, I like this new Mei. She's a bit... She's definitely the uh, determination incarnation. Alright then. Alright then. <laughs> Let's plan for the next battle. Any delays will only make things worse for us. You really like Owl, huh? <laughs> no, it's just... I um, got into this habit of just reading, and so far it's been mostly me. Yeah, that's true. Because it's, it's a rarity for a chapter to have a guy prominent. <laughs> right? May will take her head, head on. We'll engage her in the ways that we're proficient in. Yes. I'll agree to that. I will add it more fuel to the camp stove, perhaps to ward off the cold. Must first locate the Hersher. Honkai energy and freezing winds would have disabled our sensors. We can only rely on unassisted vision. I'll find an elevated position to find the target and provide you with long range support. Mm -hmm. Once we locate the Hersher, I'll set a trap with the Skepters of Duat. May will then lure the target into the trap. May nodded with approval. But the Hersher used to be a highly trained Valkyrie. A human might easily see through this trap. Only if she were a human. In the last battle, she couldn't even talk as she and was driven on by a destructive instinct. She is a unique case. May I looked at the fire in the stove and recalled what Dr. Einstein said about Hershers. That Alex Valkyrie body must be thoroughly corrupted, but her mind may still be. Resisting its influence. She appeared to be mindless only because she was still fighting the Hersha persona for control of her body. If the Hersha persona had won, we wouldn't be still seeing that instead. She's still fighting the Honkai? But we cannot afford the cost of failure. This is our best moment to strike. If we all agree to the plan, we should get started right away. Okay. 
あなたは渡りガラスに協力して成功点を探してくれ。メイ、アナの設置には少し時間が必要。Cover Raven as she moves to her elevated position. Setting the trap will take a while. ええ、わかったわ。Let's go. Okay. Alrighty. Get near the stuff for one. <laughs> this is fun. This is pretty fun. So cold. I'm freezing. May take me to this cold bear. Make this or talk to me to make this cold bearable. How does what that it's line like, doesn't uh, make sense? It's basically, it's basically like uh, she's she is called distract me, please. <laughs> Why didn't you dress for the occasion? May you're one to talk dressed like that. To be fair, she's a harsher, she doesn't give a shit. <laughs> Maybe. My specialized combat suit can tolerate low temperatures, but I never expected a tropical island to be this cold. <sighs> that brat owl opted to stay near the stove to keep himself warm. He's that type of guy. You seem to know him pretty well. Hmm. Well, he used to be a target listed in the contract they took. We met in battle. I was to take down an organization known as the Thousand Fists. He was their hired muscle. We fought each other on mobile, multiple occasions, but I always won. He hardly changed, didn't even blink or care when a blade was placed to his neck. I found him pretty interesting, so I... Let him go after destroying the Thousand Fists and recommended him to our side. He was already an officer when I saw him again, and I received a reward for the recommendation. Interesting. Though he looks sloppy, he has the skills needed to solve the problems efficiently. Grey Serpent likes to call him an effective tool. I never figured out what's going on in his head. That's why I don't like having him on my side. I mean, understandable. Doesn't matter. 
I just need him to get the job done. It's <laughs> so very nice of you. Enough talk for now. Let's push on. You lead, I'll follow. Speaking of which, you haven't given yourself an officer's code name. No, I didn't. I advise you think of one ASAP, or Jack will be the one to give you, giving you names. You don't want that to happen, right? <laughs> yes, I don't think anyone wants that to happen. <laughs> no, I, I, I don't think anybody does want Jackal's naming. Yeah, I don't. I, I don't think that's a good. That's a good idea to trust her with the naming convention. Okay, the city center was rather around the glacial formations. Raven stood atop a tower to get, to get a full view of the district. She was here. She was here before. Coral used to be an exclusive retreat for the rich, but it had become an ice locked tomb. <laughs> Perfect position for an observer. Gives me a clear view of everything. Hey, that's me. <laughs> you know, for an observer. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I chose not to say anything. <laughs> Raven assumed the front position. Her divine key created an array of glowing indigo patterns. Raven looked through the, these patterns and transformed her view into the set of overlapping blocks. The device gave Raven super physical sight that goes beyond the third dimension and revealed everything to her. Emotional, damn it! Founder. <laughs> Distance 7,400 yards in the garden at the base of the space elevator in the center of the city. Target is not moving. Good. Keep your eyes on her. No problem. Go meet up with Owl. May leaped off the tower roof and disappeared into the freezing mist. Thunder cracked and lightning flashed in the distance. Raven only saw a faint trail of her passage. <sighs> your powers can really make things so much easier. Really is. It really does make things more convenient, huh? Hello there. At the other side of the city, Ald heard a distant rumbling of thunder. He closed his eyes and counted the seconds. May appeared next to him before he could reach 30. Raven found the Hersher. Are you ready? Owl waved the scepters in his hand and placed them in his pockets. Time to do this. Let's -a go. It kind of proves to me that uh, she's only really uh, floating so so slowly because she wants to have, uh, to give people ability to catch up to her. Hey, I'm frozen. I am frozen! Dragon! Oh, you just died. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, me and my dragon having some hypothermia. I have to I have to I have to heal my heat my my hands a little bit. <laughs> May and all bra braved the freezing winds in silence as flakes of frost brushed up their combat suits. The environment became colder as they approached their harsher device. Owl's outfit, however, was stuff frozen stiff. Even May in her harsher form could sense the cold. You head back if you feel unwell. It'll get colder. No ordinary human could withstand such temperatures. May stopped and looked into the distance. Give me the scepters. Give me the scepters, and I'll handle the Hersher on my own. 
Is that what you're thinking? Well, thanks for being concerned. But I'm not as frail as you think. I'll unbutton his outfit and reveal the body that laid underneath. What? Oh. Oh, the cold won't affect me. 74% of my organs are cybernetic. These clothes are just for show. Did the serpent do this to you? I wanted them to do this to me. I'm not like you. I like innate Honkai resistance or stigmata. This is the only way to survive. What happened to you? I survived the Honkai event that took place two years ago, but it left my body with severe injuries. I joined the serpent to find a way to heal the wounds, but the search only added to the hopelessness. There was only one solution. Abandon my ailing biological body and rely on machines instead. And that's why I'm fighting for the servant. Funny, isn't it? There's nothing wrong with fighting for your own survival. Thank you. That's what I think as well. Hmm. I guess that makes sense. Machines don't get really uh don't really get affected by cold that easily. Next stage. The heart of the coral was home to an amb ambitious space elevator project that became a symbol of the city. The elevator also represented progress. It was to be the launch of pad for the new era of space exploration. But disaster struck and transformed the incomplete elevator project into a Hersher's lair. May? You're entering the Coral Elevator Base? Hersher is hidden in the gardens? She has remained silent and unmoving. Stick with the plan, I'll engage her. I need 10 minutes to set the trap and send you the coordinates where I'm done. I'll do what I can if you need help. One more thing. The Skeptors have a short fuse. Act fast and lure the Hersher to the right place. Roger, I'm moving in. Okay. Yeah, I assume I'm moving there. Yeah. Yep. This is not as cold here, seems like. Well, hello there. I would say you're you're kind of hot, but no, you're pretty cold. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Definitely gives literal meaning to Ice Queen. Uh, I froze the frozen, the frozen Hersher somehow. Somehow froze the frozen hair shirt. That's a thing that happened. Twice. Ah, uh, oh, where are you? That can help. 
Where are you? Where are you? Bonk, bonk, bonk. Oh, hello there. I see you. I see you there. <laughs> Dragon, if somehow frozen a character that is normally uh, to be damaged, received the damage, yeah, somehow frozen a uh, character that usually doesn't receive the fire damage whatsoever. I'm flying. Come on. I am not sure how exactly I managed to froze, uh, freeze uh, her share of ice, but I did freeze her share of ice. Hello. Ah, oh, fuck off, of course. But hey, Polar Dog. Appreciate you being here. Hey, where are you? Yay! The Frozen Guard, guarded with some dread by raging vortex of Honkai Axe and Thunder. The two powers clashed, burned, and clashed crushed each other and destroyed everything within sight no physical law or rule of engagement could describe the ruthless nature of the battle of hershers right in may my trap is ready lure the target to the indicated coordinates with that may transform into a bolt of lightning flying through her gaps with an ice towards the indicated position a cold stream tailed the indigo wake of lightning, sprouting blossoms of razor-sharp ice to shred its prey. Fass! Bolts of energy penetrated the mist. From miles away, ravens sniped and shattered the deadly obstacles for me. I've arrived at the target location. So, Hershers aren't affected by extreme weather, so why does May have a hypothermia bar? Because, um... Her, her boob is frozen. Is freezing. Yep. Specifically boob. One. Left one. <laughs> I don't know. I came, up with, I came up with this on the spot. Affirmative. I've confirmed the Hersher of Path. Activating the Skepters of Duat. Wrapped in Sub-Zero Mantle, the Hersher of Dice hurtled towards May. The Lightning Queen readied herself. Oh, now's the time. The response was unexpected Pog! silence. <laughs> the response was unexpected. Pog! <laughs> so thank you. That actually, for, for the first time, that, that, that subscription button ended up in a, very, uh, in a very good timing. The response was unexpected. Pog! <laughs> I guess a Pog was really unexpected in this situation, that's for sure. <laughs> that would definitely be unexpected. Ow. This is Skeptor of Duat. Uh oh! Backstab you! <laughs> Curse it! Hey, hey what's happening? Who's. <laughs> You best hurt. 
Uh oh, backstab you. I mean, who's really surprised about that? Nobody. Uh, I know it's for just uh, just for gameplay purposes, but it's funny that she specifically said the cold weather doesn't affect her, and immediately after she has to deal with hypothermia bar. <laughs> yes, yes, for sure. I know it's. I do know it's for gameplay, but yeah, it's kind of funny. <laughs> it is. It is kind of funny. Wimp! Let's do EX2. Yes. Yes. Uh, uh, whatever. I don't... Uh. Lego! My uh, time to showcase my favorite uh, battle suit so far that I play with when I, when I'm not doing story stages. Don't bunk bunk. I love the the, the the automatic response of this uh, battle suit. It was just like, oh, by the way, you, you think you can do something, but you can't do anything here. I'm just going to stop you from that. No, I, I disagree. <laughs> right. How about now? <laughs> Uh, Paladin Equinox isn't a bad battle suit, but when it comes to physical damage, I prefer my prefer my Hersher. Okay, what is this? Uh, of rebirth. Ah, Hersher of rebirth. I I still don't have a lot of uh, battle suits. This is like the strongest one I got so far. I would say. So that's why I enjoy, I enjoy playing her because she is. Ab ab this objectively is the strongest suit I have right now. Dark Tides in the East, an action thriller, thriller, thriller novel based on the conflicts of Southeast Asian secret societies and currently one of the most popular novels for young adults. The novel provides an expose of underground organizations and the little known history of gangs and gang warfare. Many of the plot details are inspired by real world events. The fan favorite chapters that covered the rise and fall of the Thousand Fists were largely based on actual, on an actual events that took place in Singapore during 2016. Rumors say that the criminal organization was annihilated overnight by an unknown mercenary who operated alone. The only evidence left by at the crime scene was a floor covered in black feathers. Even to this day, date, police investig poli polis police investigation has yet to find, um, yet to make any progress. The story was covered by every media outlet and gave rise to numerous urban legends around the mysterious assassin and the Thousand Fists itself of which Dark Tides in the East is by far the most successful portrayal. The novel is now getting a television drama and movie adaptation. It won't be long before we can relieve the legend on screen. Hmm. No! No. That's not a starter supply. I got, uh, I got Durandal off. Which, let me actually check. I'm actually curious. Nothing like having somebody just join your Discord server right now and immediately message you and it say art bot. That's an instant server ban. Yeah. I think I got her from uh, either focus supply or event supply or something along the lines, but I definitely got a... Oh, actually, let me do this. It's like... This bot wasn't even in my server all of five seconds before they messaged me. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> yeah, I think I got e I got her from one of the later uh, supplies. Uh, let me actually check which one I got, uh, which ones I got, like, in general. Which, 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 which Valkyries I got in general before we continue. Um, I got Kiana Koslana, 
White Comet, Crimson Impulse, Ride and May, uh, Bronya Zaychik, Valkyrie Car Chariot, uh, Kiana Kasla Kaslana, Valkyrie Ranger, Raiden, Valkyrie Blade Strike, uh, Gyakushin Miko, Yai Sakura, Bronya Zaychik, Snowy Sniper, Scarlet Fusion, Murata Himiko, Lilia Olenyeva, uh, Lilia Olenyeva, Blubri Blitz, uh, Valkyrie Accept Accipiter, I think, or whatever. Rita Royce Weiss, Umbral Rose, Silly, Valere, Swallowtail Phantasm, Durandal, Valkyrie Gloria, Natasha Siora, Natasha Kiora, Midnight Absentee. Midnight Absinthe, Yai Sakura, Dark Blo Dark Blo Dark Bolt Jonin, Kiana Kaslana, Hersher of the Void, Bronya Zaichik, Yamabuki Armor, Durandal, Platinus Equinox, and uh, uh, Kira Shigure, Shigure Starburst. These are the t these are the uh, these are the ones I got so far. I'm hoping I will get a few more, uh, maybe one or two more S classes. Uh, Europe. It's Europe. I'm fairly certain it's Europe. Fairly certain it's it's uh, Europe. Probably. Because it's whichever one you're on that's playing. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's so. the, uh, it's the, yeah, I'm fairly certain it's Europe. Okay, let's do this. Oh, yeah, it is, it is Europe. Okay, let's do this. Meanwhile, Shisko Valkyrie has barricaded all passages along the outskirts of Coral. Hongkai beasts forged of the of, of ice hurled themselves at defenses. The true disaster has only just begun. <laughs> Master Durandal, the weather is becoming unstable. This cold Hankai's dream is turning into a cataclysmic storm. Rita's face was somber with apprehension as she looked under the darkening skies. We must neutralize our Hersher before she disrupts the tropical climate system and creates a global disaster. Alphita, how are the serpents doing? Well, it's just as Adjutant Rita said, has said, the storm has cut our comm links. From the last message we received, the serpent seems to have engaged the Hersher. But I think they ran into a few problems, the serpent officer named Owl betrayed them. And I also found something odd while studying Anna Shark's files. With a beep, I'll later switch the comms display to show yet another file. Who is this guy? A survivor who I found in one of Anna Shark's mission debriefing log. Tuan Chin, male. Anna saved him during the Hankai event and took place in Asia two years ago. And this Mr. Chin uh, happened to be Serpent Officer Owl, whom I just mentioned. Uh, okay, I can see what's happening now. He wasn't intent yep. on betraying her, betraying the Serpent, but he also was unwilling to do whatever this is to the to the person who saved him. Right. Hmm. So this serpent officer met Anna before? Something doesn't look right. We should move at once. Squad leader? Shouldn't we wait for comlinks to be back online? We should report to this HQ. Uh, 
can't risk waiting. We don't have the time. Shame people from different servers can't interact with one another. From I'm from Global America myself. I see, I see. Right. We now have to act according to our best judgment. Well, honestly, it's a gacha game. I'm really excited to see what kind of gacha uh, roles I will get in the future and whatever what what uh, new suits and battle suits I will get because that's the exciting part of gachas. You never know exactly where your playstyle shifts depending on what suits and characters you get. That's basically that's exciting for me as a free to play player. Like, right. I, I recently rolled in another gacha, Path to Nowhere, off-stream, right? And I got um, and I got myself the um, Oak Casket, which was, like, the prominent uh, long-range shooter character, right? And that immediately changed the way I approached the, ch the um, team building there, because now I have this really strong unit that I can place in the back lines that will clear uh, pro the approaching forces. Like, it's really is exciting. It, it really changes the way you think about the game. Uh, if you don't have any, just every item unlocked, uh, every uh, character unlocked, I would say that's how I approach gacha games. Just yep, what you get is what you get, and you need to f defeat the game based on what you get. So, yeah, Wait, Abner, you mentioned that the comlinks were cut. How did you get the data? Uh, yeah, it's part of being the official tool. I figured this might happen, so I kept a local backup. Making unauthorized copies of data is a serious offense, Elevator. Uh, H, yeah, I did hear about the 2.0. Uh... Honkai Impact 3rd is assumed to going to receive its biggest update in its seven, almost eight years of existence, where we'll get new graphics, new gameplay, new UI, and most importantly, an entirely new cast of characters. So that's going to be a fun thing to experience. I'm a five plus year veteran myself. I've been around these lands since 2018. Huh? That's cool. We have started uh, Honkai Impact, if I'm not mistaken, uh... Well, me specifically. Yeah. Let me actually check how long it was. Uh, at least uh, I, I know I can, I can tell you for sure how long ago um, Alexia has joined in the fray. 18 chapters ago. Time-wise. <laughs> I mean, first nine chapters we were clearing about to, up until chapter 8 we were doing 2 a week yeah 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 basically I mean it's like minimal amount of story until this point so that makes sense let me see we started uh, chapter 2 together with Alexia 3 months ago about that hey Pikachu specifically on 26th of June we started that would be about right, yes. Yep, 26th of June. You can check your login... Uh, login days in-game. Yep, uh, 26th of June we started. To, we started Chapter 2, basically. And before that, I took a dip in the Honkai Impact um, off on my Twitch days. So basically, I started around... At around the start of summer, basically, I've been playing since around the start of summer, just a little bit, a little, a little earlier, maybe. But yeah, so give or take three, four, five months. Yep, about that. Yeah, my my play time is about five months myself. With about a couple times in there where we had to do nothing, so I'd say four months. Yeah, four months. Yeah, four months is a good is a good estimate. What? But I. I've only done it in case of emergencies. Rita, I'm giving you temporary command of the Valkyries. I'm heading to check out the Hersher. Alone? Our positions here are just as important. I need you to lead the defenses and keep the Honkai at bay. Of course. And I'll be decisive if the Serpent tries anything funny. 
Please be careful out there. Not bad. You've been here a while already. Yeah, yeah. I do. De I definitely have been. Uh, out of all the games, I would say, in terms of um, gacha games so far I played, uh, I have been the most in Zdorica and this one, Honka Impact. Yeah. See, which one are you supposed to be doing with Vivi before she pulled out of doing just about everything? Uh, Vivi, I was supposed to do Arc Knights with. Okay. So, understandably, it didn't replace anyone. Uh, with... Oh, it is. It is better I... than Genshin's storyline, from what I've seen. Genshin line storyline is kind of. <laughs> I don't know about Star Rail, but it's definitely been better than like uh, than Genshin so far. Even though I didn't like play too much of Genshin yet, I played like a little bit. You know, if you enjoy. How's Arc Knights? Huh? How is Arc Knights? I have no idea. I haven't tried it yet. Okay, because I just noticed that there's a anime of it now. Yeah, there's a second season came out recently. I would have been playing Arc Knights for a b at least three months. I feel like if uh, Vivi didn't pull out. So, unfortunate. That's what he said. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. Uh, but the, the game, yeah, we have been enjoying the game. Uh, the early, these early chapters can be a bit slow, but they get really good uh, very quickly. Yeah, I think earlier chapters got really uh, annoying to read sometimes because of how they were crafted. Uh, like yes, they were just rushing were... ahead. The script and writing of the first couple of chapters were bad. Very bad. And, they, and it kept rushing ahead like super quickly. Arknights is basically a pretty dense, text-heavy world-building campaign. Yeah, that's basically it. With, I can believe it. The yeah. anime seems to be the same way, which is why I didn't enjoy it and dropped it after two episodes. Yep. It's good, though. Uh, I kind of like the a lot of the... Um, I like the way... I, I already watched a few videos about this. The music is amazing. They produce their own music. They have a, their own music comp uh, company. Uh, they also have uh, like very rich, very thick world building. If you know what you're looking for, you can easily find it. It's 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 good. I will plan to I plan to introduce the game into my repertoire at some point. Yes, and watch over this place for me. Uh, the first two chapters, I feel uh, like, were written during a time where Hoyvers didn't know what exactly they wanted Honkai Impact to, uh, 3 to become. But after they figured out their plans, it got good. Yep, I would agree so, with that. Um, a lot of the characters, they were, I would say, uh, for considering what they did, they did pretty amazingly. They were put in a very tight spot in terms of, like, characters, because the characters were fucking dog shit. <laughs> and they had to, like elevate those characters from uh, from that to there yeah i could see that being something it's actually, it's actually kind of fun though to be fair uh If you if you heard of Malazan, Arknight is that, but less obtuse and with a lot of more ifus. They actually cut down and partially rewrote the first few chapters entirely. Yeah, really, that's cool. Um, actually, Polar Dog, uh, any information on one two point will be coming out. I'm actually curious about that. I did I did see the trailer for it, and the gameplay I find to be really good. Uh, H13, uh, Honkai Impact 3 uh, so far is the only game that actually made me cry multiple times because of its story. It sometimes just hits you like a punch in the gut and you start blowing your eyes out. Um... Okay, yeah, I do agree. Um, in my case, it does. it's not the single game. Um... Around February for 2.0? 
Mm -hmm. I see. Uh, in my case, um, another game that made me tear up and like get choked up. Several games my, uh, among my my repertoire: Path to Nowhere, which which it managed to do within four chapters. I I am mistaken. It managed to do within two two chapters, because it's depressing. <laughs> Zdarika, um, which second season managed to tear, make me tear up several times, um, and. What else? I think a few other games I play. Uh, a lot of other games I play have have this really brutal narrative to them. Um, though the one game that comes to mind in terms of like really depressing, really strong hitting narrative, I would say Path to Nowhere would be another game, which also nobody knows. <laughs> it's kind of a shame. Other hand, guy captains uh, often refer to the game as depression impact for a very for a very good reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do agree on that. I do agree on that. Okay, let's see. Uh, if you guys want, if you guys are curious in other gacha games I play, you can check out the VODs here, because some of them I just started on this channel, and the other ones I have a, a extensive backlog of videos tracing to my Twitch days of playing them. So I have all of my journeys right here on this channel from start to finish from start to the current point if you want to catch up to any of these they are freely available to watch wish i could make it to where twitch would automatically upload the videos to youtube rather than manually have to do each one yeah but it is what it is it's whatever yep the frost covered sheet street, street street was traced through it by a dark trail as a thought, words hard words hard as, a, uh, as though a line was drawn across the sheet of paper version 3.0 for us in global should be around february march of 2024 i see i see so start of next year that's good that's a good estimate first quarter of the uh of 2024 that's a good estimate yeah they should be able to prepare uh, apparently uh it's will the first cam for every what will every story be affected by the gameplay change is this such a massive undertaking that will be interesting to see if that's the case because if uh, will the older chapters keep their gameplay or will will be everything be updated like that is the question i have right now if everything will be updated, that will be kind of kind of kind of impressive to see. <laughs> Speaking of updates, because I know this runs off of Unity and then so many other things. Did Unity actually backtrack from their plan? Uh, there, this runs on Chinese Unity. It doesn't get affected. Okay. Yeah. Because I know the CEO ended up getting fired. Yep. Yeah, uh, these runs on uh, Chinese Unity, even if the back, uh, the changes were not backtracked. It would not affect um, Honkai at all. Okay. Honkai Genshin would not. They have like a their own patented patent version of Unity they're using, which is like basically an offshoot. Probably. May was the place. Oh, was the May was the place where the line ended and stopped before the ice. She swung her blade against the frozen barrier. She was alone in this bleak witness whiteness. She parried the ice her shirt attack and slowly restored the powers that were drained by the skippers of Duat. Raven? Ow? Do you copy? May tried calling her fellow allies on the comm device, but there was nothing but silence. She pi pieced uh, the evidences together and realized that they all pointed towards the impossible. She coalesced the Honkai energy and restored her Hersher powers. She must find the Hersher of ice and uncover the ultimate truth. I don't know if she's gonna piece it together properly. I mean, she already uh, she already kind of realized what is happening here. I mean, she knows Owl was the one behind that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's pretty obvious, but yeah, yeah, yeah. He's the he's the one who possessed the uh, the scepters of Duat. Damn. 
Leave it to the dragon, just sh melt things. Yep. yep. May. Uh, her dormant calm device came to life. Raven spoke weakly through it. Raven? What happened? Owl, he betrayed us. Owl? Why? I don't know. Use the scepters on you, and then he stabbed me in the back. He took my divine key, but he could, can't use the obtained powers without authentication. Are you alright? Well, she's clearly she's clearly talking, so that's the thing. To be honest, I feel terrible. Use some fo form of neurotoxin on me. Don't waste time helping me. You must chase them down. Don't let them escape with that Hersher. Take care of yourself, Raven. I'll go after the Hersher. May, I have another piece of bad news for you. Durandel, she's... She's heading to your position right now. Don't know that that classifies as bad news. I mean, to be fair, she's not. She's not exactly. A, uh, she's not exactly 100% aware if she's going to be there for uh, as an ally or uh, is there. If this is the moment where she uh, she utilizes the the uh, grudge that clearly is there. They don't exactly know Durandal uh, Durandal's character. Right in May. Are you still in fighting shape? Yeah. Of Go course ahead. I am. Then follow me. We don't have time to waste. Let's go. Man, this is a great. This is an interesting team up, huh? <laughs> this is a very interesting team up, actually. Yeah, that's going to be interesting. The Lee was silent and lifeless. Even time itself seemed to have frozen over. The Hersher of Ice hovered above the fountain. Her intents and feelings were hidden by the Dark Veil. Though she had just fought the Lightning Queen, the Ice Hersher appeared to be extremely calm. She was expecting something. The man approaching her from a distance may know the answer. The joints of all metallic skeleton creaked as he stiffly walked across the icy garden. He called out her name as she staggered towards the Hersher. We meet again, Anna. The eyes began to shift. The Hersher slowly raised her head. Her gaze rested upon his covered face, frost covered face. She hovered towards him. The frozen beds of flower melted, allowing time to flow once more. I did not expect us to meet like this. To meet again like this. Hersher issued a harsh and unintelligible murmur. A lament of sorrow and regret. Owl took out a glittering pendant from his pocket. The pendant gave off a warm glow that contrasted against his cold metallic body. Do you still remember this pendant, Anna? Do you still have the other half? Did you lose it? He was always the careless one. He looked at the Hersher and gave her a bitter smile. It's just another trinket. It doesn't matter if you remember it or not. I'll fulfill, I'll fulfill my promise. Have no fear. No matter what happens today, I'll be at your side. I owe you my life, and I shall gladly sacrifice it for your sake. There was a determination in his soft words. Owl extended his hand to touch her cheeks. Hersha did not flinch. His trembling mechanical manipulators brushed against her face. Though his robotic extremities were insensitive to the temperature, and she had lost her tactile senses, the touch sensor rippled that resonated with both of them. Anna. I know, I know you still you're holding on. Please remember who you really are. Don't let the Honkai consume your heart. Owl! Stay out of my way, Hersher of Thunder. 
I love her idol animation. It's just kind of like I'm gonna spin. Yep. My, I'm gonna. It's, yeah. It's nice. Yeah. She has her own katana, and the katana, the, the, the big, the big, the big katana, on the in the thunder. Ah, I see. So that's what that's how it works. You need to change. You need to change. Uh, before you get to yeah, that full bar. Seems like May actually does more damage now than Durandal. Yep. I think, uh... Bonk, bonk. Bonk! Bunk, 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 bunk. Yeah, this Durandal clearly is more a bit of a more a bit of a more tanky aesthetic. Yep. And May is definitely DPS. Yeah, May is very DPS. -y. Hey, four elemental. Hello, elemental. Okay, yeah. She, uh, such a shame she doesn't. She didn't keep that big katana move set after chapter seventeen. That was uh, the one I thought was the coolest uh, of uh, of her. I think I like this one. This is chapter eighteen, and I really like this one. Yep. It's very, it's very active and involved, and I actually do a lot of things, just like I do a lot of things with the uh, Durandal's Equinox form. Because she also changes forms, she can block, she can parry, she can like a bash, a shield bash, and then do a super move. She can jump on a horse and like jump off the horse as the ultimate thing. It's really cool. May and Duradal bridged the encirclement of Honkai beasts and came up before Owl and I Ice Hersher. Owl, do you know what you're doing? Of course I do. I will save Anna and free her from the shackles of Honkai. She will be human once more. I know what the World Serpent has in store for her. You refuse to give me a chance, I have no other choice. However, you proved to me that Hersher powers could be mastered, right in May. I will help Anna do the same. I will take the Hersher vice by her hand. A powerful blizzard engulfed them at once. You're not going anywhere. The Rundal leaped into the action and became a blue comet that streaked into the sky. May was rooted to her spot. Her heart was filled with twisting vines of conflict, indecision, and doubt. Many nights had passed since May had left her at Nagazora. She knew she had to decide, decide eventually. May convinced herself that this was all for her. She did it for to foil her destiny. Indeed, those were her reasons. She must do whatever it takes to seal the Hersher of Ice. It's a moment. Yeah, I mean, do, I do understand what she, where May is coming from here. Like, she's like deciding, should she try to help uh, this Ice person become just as her? Or should she just go with the mission anyway? It's, 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 a, good, it's, a, it's a good indecision point, I feel like. For someone who is a yep. Hersher herself. Unlike the previous indecision points, where, where, which were kind of weird. <laughs> the blizzard howled at the eye of the storm swallowed at the teetering space elevator. Durandal, ever the agile warrior, held out against the Hersher of, uh, in the deadly cold. The stalemate between the Valkyrie and the Hersher was suddenly shattered by a bolt of lightning. Raiden May glared at her foe. The lucky in Skeptors of Duat, she must find a way to seal her. She could not afford to lose. I believe I have failed to convince you. 
I'll hear nothing more. I will not let you stop me. They come and face me. Just as I'll prepare his weapon, a high-pitched scream was unleashed from the storm. Okay. Okay. It's Something's merging from the ice. It's very quiet. Oh, that's a beast. I don't know when I'm going to be doing next reaction stream, Danny. I decided to not really keep uh, a, 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 like a concrete uh, schedule. I'm going to be doing a lot of streams as usual, right? But uh, I'm going to be like playing a lot of it by, by ear. Because I feel like having like this overarching, overbearing schedule, I already mentioned it before. But it's not exactly good for my... Uh, Uh, enthusiasm for streaming. Bunk! <laughs> Let's let's destroy it. Let's try attempt to destroy the That's a tanky boss. Yeah. Compared to everything else, was just shredded. Yeah, all right. it was. It was. It is pretty, pretty tanky. I did shatter the. Uh... Oh, well, that definitely did something. Yeah, I did. I shattered the uh, the armor. There it goes. Yep. There we are. Oh, brother, okay. Though team up of uh, of uh, of Durandal and May is not something I ever expected to see. <laughs> no, nope. I, I have to be I have to be honest. But yeah, uh, feel free to tell me, guys, if you know uh, when uh, exactly will the uh, two, what exactly 2.0 will affect. Okay, that was cool. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> I have, I have, I, t I have units. She says. Yeah, did you not? I have units. I don't have units. <laughs> Again, I somehow froze on the froze the frozen uh, her share. That was a thing that happened. Right. Okay. Stop. Don't hurt Nana.
Ooh, you know? Similar to the, yes, similar to look. The Shadow of Veil revealed a similar a familiar, side familiar to Mei. <sighs> she resisted the storm of her emotion and radiated her weapon to her strike. But all stood before her to stop her blade. Raiden Mei, you'll have to get through me if you want to get her, kill her. His severely damaged mechanical body fared poorly in the cold. Sparks flew from the fallen circuitry. Yet he refused to back down. Mei was taken aback. The decision that Owl has made was too familiar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll gladly trade my life for hers. Yeah. She saved my life and I shall save hers in return. This is a good chapter to test May. This is a really good chapter to test May. It is, yes. She's literally seen the exact mirror of what the decision she made back then. The man made the same exact choice she did back then. I'm all here in my life, and I'd gladly die to protect her from you. Why do you hold back, right in May? The comet streaked past her lance, aimed directly at Laol. And then the mighty storm erupted right in the middle of the battlefield. The Hesher's Whale released a massive amount of energy stored within her core. Mela Duradal held out against the frigid blast that swept over them. The entire island shook from the force. A giant glacial formation emerged from the elevator like a snow lotus in its full bloom. The freezing wave overwhelmed everything in sight. The Hesher of Ice in Oho was nowhere to be seen. I will support the Hersher and trudged along the stricken city. She spent all her powers to deliver that blast. There were two fragile flakes of snow that would break apart at any moment. But however difficult every step could be, I'll refuse to break or fall. There was one single voice left in him. I'll do whatever it takes to help you survive this, Anna. Ah, oh, that's interesting. Th yep, this so is... made to make a choice yet no she made a choice but she got she got ass blasted with with, with a vision of herself in the past <laughs> that's that's kind of that's that i don't think that's something you can just overcome in a moment you know right unfortunately i feel like it's just it's just very unfor unfortunate for her that she had to uh she had to overcome that basically yeah Uh, actually, we do. We before we do EX, we do. We can, in fact, do the uh, a roll, single yep, general. Let's do a pull. So, which one? Which one? Expansion or focused? Which one should we do? Do you think? Do focused. Yeah, let's do focused. Oh no, focused. I need. I need one more for focused. Okay. Yeah, I need one more for focused. A little bit. Uh, just a little bit more. Just a little bit. Let me quickly do that little bit. Do we get uh, money for it? No. Oh, so okay. Yeah, EX yeah. Four. EX three and four. If I do EX three and four, I can. I, I'll be able to get it. Good. That's my first, actually, I think that's my first focused uh, supply since a while because it's like, it takes a, a good chunk of uh, of these gems to do this. At least the game, the game is fairly honest in terms of like, uh... In terms of how much, I, uh, how much characters you get, you know? Yep. Bonk. <laughs> Horse! <laughs> 
successful horse. <laughs> Very successful horse. Also boob. <laughs> yep. Okay. Uh, one done. Yeah, one more and then we'll do the, the supply. One more and then we'll do the supply. Oh yeah, figure. Yeah, that's not even that. Considering this is a... Okay, so it doesn't, uh, it doesn't look count as a... Get juggled, honestly. Right? <laughs> 120,000 damage. I died. It's fine. Let, let's uh, yeah, let's let's redo it real quickly. Yep. I got I got I think I got bitch slapped by a few by a few things there. You did. And I didn't pay attention to the to the half. And that was my beard, my beard, very my beard. That was my beard. Okay, let's see where you Bump, bump, uh, bump, yeah, bump. Let's uh let's utilize uh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Okay, let's do this. 120. Okay, cool. Yep. Almost took it yeah. down. Yeah, I destroyed. I completely destroyed the armor. Uh, the thing that the, the thing that was making it a little obnoxious. Except that it's got back. of the void is is uh, is very useful for uh distance damage if you need to the, if you yep. need to do poke damage a lot okay then any cutscene at the end no okay let's try this actually 
Well, at least yes. uh, at least we know from this image that she is uh she actually managed to regain uh becomes a character with a story apparently. Yeah. She managed to regain her consciousness at the, at the very least. At the very least for the moment. Uh which is good, I would say. <laughs> Yep. We need more cool uh we need more cool sentient harshers. Really, we need really need to. I think uh keeping harsher as just monsters that uh, that mindless beasts are uh, so, uh, I don't know. Focus A or focus B. Do 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 Wishing well. Couldn't set. This is a stigmata, I think, set. Uh, Supply is the focus a stigmata? It might be a stigmata. Weapon or stigmata. It might be a weapon of a stigmata. And this is battle suit. Okay. Well, either way, it is. Uh, it is the same. It is the same kind of. Ah, let's do this. Let's do the expansion supply then. Yeah. Oh, I got this. That's nice. More battle suit shards. That's amazing. Thank you. More battle suit shards. I could actually, I could potentially level up. Uh, maybe, potentially level up the uh, Durandal. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Yeah, I could potentially level up Durandal. Let me actually shop. Ah, okay, shop. Supply shop. Do, 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 do. Oh, there's a battle suit for Kiana. Yeah, it's Kiana. Supply shop. Do, 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 do. Maybe. Do 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 do. Oh, Luna Kindred Cell. That's cool. Uh, required forties to unlock. I can do 90, 19 right now. That's a decent. That's a decent chunk. To cash to actually about, unlock uh, it. For Himiko. Valkyrie's Triumph, uh, Scarlet Fusion. Those are the ones yeah, I have for her. Oh, you already have those two? Yeah, but it's like upgrading them from uh, rank A ah, to rank S, okay. for example. Uh, Midnight Absinthine, that's, uh, that's Raven. 50 fragments to evolve her to, um, to S. The S rank, which would be cool, actually. Because I like Raven. She seems like a fun character. Uh, any, any, what, you, anything you guys, you guys have to say from the chat? Which one should I get? There's a I'm Knight Squire. I'm kind of leaning towards Himiko or for Raven. Yeah, I'm kind of, I'm kind of leaning towards either Himiko or Raven as well. I think Raven. Uh, we already have our heart hitter, big heart hitter in uh, Durandal. Yep. So I feel like agile, uh, someone agile would be cool to have. All right, uh, there's this, there's something thing for. Okay. It's fine. I I will uh. Okay, so let's see. Uh, yeah, that does make sense. Keep them in, uh, reserved till you can get enough to rank up in one go. Diane Cora, that's interesting. Yeah, I need the, uh, I need the uh, like. Uh... 
Hmm. I wonder how uh, how you get the how you you can get stuff uh, from for S stuff from for SS and everything. I do recommend grabbing whatever builds as fragments are on sale for coins for the first shop and some of the okay cool 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 yeah well, let's actually do that actually because I have a fuck ton of dorm coins. Doom, doom. Yeah. Uh, supply shop for coins. Yeah, we'll grab this. We'll grab this. Hmm. Yeah, we'll grab this. Uh, exchange shop. Supply. Um, basic currency. That's daily shop. What do we have for daily shop? Exchange. Uh, yep, that's 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 decent. Two stamina and then money. Nice. Nice. Uh, level up rewards. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, and then uh, one more, uh, one more for dorm supply. Bonk. Two more dorm supplies. Crystals are for use of the brother ship ship. You can use some pretty good equipment once in a while. Okay, cool. I figured. Ooh, hey, hey, May. Converted, converted into fragments. Um, I suppose I could I could eventually upgrade me to a pretty pretty fast state if I keep, keep getting me. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Crimson impulse. Yeah. Yeah. It's cool. So what are your impressions of the of chapter of this chapter? Well, it was a better chapter for more character development on May, so that was good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The fact that she didn't falter ultimately and decided to go with, along with the with her plan anyway, that was pretty cool. Yep. Um, I'm actually curious what will happen with these two. Right. Uh, I'm not sure I do I think I'm not sure if they will survive or not this entire situation but I do know the uh, serpent needs the fifth hersher li alive right I don't know that I'm not exactly sure about the, the owl if he's gonna be uh, around for much longer hopefully he will be hopefully we'll they both find uh, out yeah hopefully they will both be around um, you think we should stop here for now yeah, because I'm going to have to head out in an hour anyways, so... Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think we're going to be stopping. We're going to be doing one chapter this one this time and one chapter next time. And then uh, yep. we're going to be stopping, starting uh, Taijuan Dream uh, later uh, later down the line. Yep, because we're all s almost at three hours anyways, so... Mm, like two and a half hours, but yeah. But two yep. and hours and forty minutes. We are basically like that. I feel like it's a good, it's a good sign. Um, it's a good, it's 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 a good s uh, stage to end the stream, though. Uh, I do like this. Uh, the direction is going though. Uh, it's it, it. I know how it usually goes. Like each uh, each of these segments is basically a self-contained storyline. Right. But like that plays into each of the storylines before that. And uh, then the next, uh, but uh, I I like how the Hersher of the uh, um, the fifth Hersher arc is built is being dealt with um, by the forces we consider uh, we consider the antagonistic from from this point to this point from under the falling sky to elegy to yesterday, but now we have a right. we have an actual point POV in um, in. Now we have an actual POV in uh, in serpents. Yep. 
Yep. So that's good. I'm gonna look forward to learning more about Kevin. I look forward to learning about more about how May is going to operate within this new life of hers. I have to agree, yes. And I have to I am very curious to see what will happen with these two people here. That will be interesting, yeah. For now though, I'm gonna be taking a pause here and I'm gonna be returning back with something I wanted to start before, but I'm gonna be returning back with Fate Samurai Remnant today in like a bit. I'm gonna do a thumbnail for it. I'm gonna do it. And that's gonna be how that's gonna be how I operate. I'm gonna do thumbnail in the moment, right? I'm gonna be posting the scheduled posts like in few hours before the stream. And that's how I'm gonna be op operating this. So people can be uh, so people can be fully aware of what exactly I'm doing like in the day, but I, they, they won't really be aware of what exactly I'm doing uh, otherwise, right? It's easier for my consciousness, effectively. Yep. Because I feel really bad when I miss streams, and I tend to miss streams a fair bit because of uh, circumstances that are often under, uh, outside of my control. So if Yeah, I've kind of been doing that last couple of weeks too, planning to stream, and then I just don't. And that's really depressing. That brings my mood down big time. I, I can't can't really can't really yeah. uh, handle this. Yeah. But anyways, yeah. I'm going to go in in things here. Yep, so here. it's been a pleasure having everybody and let me go ahead and raid out to someone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, do before we do end, I do want to ask if is if anyone is aware if um, if anyone is aware if 2.0 changes will take place and across the entire gameplay, because I'm not exactly sure how version 2.0 and version 1.0 will be working with each other. Because I do know it will not be a separate app; it will be just in-app complete update. But will the gameplay changes take place only after, uh, only in the new storyline, or the old storylines are also affected? Because I that, would be. I have no idea. Yeah, I'm asking people who are like veterans here, who are aware of uh, everything, because I'm pretty sure I have a few veterans around. Asking the important questions there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's kind of it's kind of important to know because. I would like I would like to be prepared to play the playing the first version the first time uh, version two point like I want to be I want to be like uh, if we don't finish the storyline of uh, the finality which we probably won't be finishing <laughs> until version two point probably probably not they're almost definitely not going to be working the entire game uh and the hundred plus valks they'll probably just add the jump button to them but then how would how do they how do they expect us to play the new storyline with the old valkyries that have been not reworked to uh to be added into the game like it doesn't make sense why not just make at this point why not just make it a separate app they have all of this all of these I have all of these. All of these. Huh, nice. Yeah, this is the uh, this is the final ver this is oh this is the final form. <laughs> what is the light what is the final form? Oh nice. I love I like her. <laughs> I like her form, the final form. Okay. Right. And uh, this is the Asher of Reason. And this is the final version of Bronya. I see, I see, I see. Hmm. We already have two Kianas who can air, do air combos with Appa, which you probably haven't tried, where you can also do air combos. Uh, yeah, I, I guess so, yeah. I mean, we'll, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see how they do it, but I will be very impressed if they actually update the entire game. Like, if you just basically roll out the update and completely rehash the entire game. That would be kind of impressive. Yep. 
Either way, uh, for now, we're going to be stopping. I'm going to be returning with the uh, Samurai Remnant in a second. But yes, uh, I'll be back. But uh, wish um, my sister here a good time too as well. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, everybody. I'll be back. Bye-bye, 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 bye-bye.